when your legs don't work like they used to before And I can't sweep you off of your feet Will your mouth still remember the taste of my love? Will your eyes still smile from your cheeks? Darling, I will be loving you till we're 17 she was actually uh, the makeup artist that I have found on Instagram, thanks to Instagram, even though I don't have Instagram. Um, but for some reason, I remember calling there and saying, oh my God, hair makeup is going to be like $500. And, and it was like, is she worth it? If she, you like hair work, then go with her. And and I did, and I'm so glad I did because Abby was more than um, a makeup artist, really. And more than a hair stylist, actually. Now, she really helped, even when it came to the day of the wedding, like in the morning we were all rushing, she literally dressed me up. Can we get Max here? Of course, they have my mom and my maid of honor is my sister and uh, Chanel, my best friend, so um, I'm just grateful. Take me into your loving arms Kiss me under the light of a thousand stars I thought it was the cutest thing to see um, Nero's best best man Joe bring me the gifts on the wedding day. Um, it wasn't totally a surprise. I knew he was gonna put some stunt like that. But one thing that I never wear. Anybody that knows me knows this. I never wear necklaces. Like I am an earring person. <laughs> And so of course, what did Nick go get me? A necklace. And here is actually the necklace that he got me. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, I hope that I can actually wear this again and again. And hopefully never take it off, but who knows? Maybe it was a week. <laughs> Baby, you smiles forever. Walking down the aisle. Let's see. Um, you know, it's interesting. Most people say they get nervous as they walk down the aisle. And for some reason, I didn't feel like that. Actually, even though I was coming down the stairs with my dad, I wasn't nervous about tripping or falling or any of those craziness. If anything, uh, I was so excited and... <laughs> <laughs> I just couldn't wait to see Nick down the aisle, you know, I was just really laser focused on him until we got off the, um, off the stairs and then I, I saw my college friends, my graduate school friends, uh, people from the neighborhood, from the church and everywhere and, you know, it, it was just so beautiful and so exciting to see people actually showing up on time, um, kudos to all those people, but, and they see Nick. Yes, this is Angela. <laughs> so baby now, take me into your After we done saying our I, I do's and we were leaving the um, ceremony, I remember thinking in my head, I hope somebody get a good shot. <laughs> No, seriously, I, I was just hoping that somebody would get a good shot of me and Nero just coming down the aisle with the bubbles and I actually hope that people do not forget to blow the bubbles because uh, two days before the wedding, I had met with Mohammed, the coordinator of, at the um, Sandcastle and he was saying how no matter what they do at every wedding, when they even hand out the bubbles, people always forget to blow the bubbles like why did we give you the bubbles blow the bubbles and surprisingly people actually did so that was exciting and you know of course just flying away with me and all the excitement that comes with it um it was a beautiful wedding I'm thinking out loud, maybe we found love right where we are when my hair's all but gone and my memory fades 
when we got to the bridal yeah, the suite, of course, there's a plasma the TV that is in our suite, so we can actually see what everything else that was happening. And then all of a sudden, we hear this really the crowd just going crazy, just I guess really into the music. And just seeing Shirley and Yan, I mean, the way they were dancing, it was like they were just, they have been practicing, like they have actually rehearsed their moves. And hey, I give it to my sister, Shirley. She is not really your best dancer, but girl, did she put it down. Kudos to you, Shirley. You, you did good, my boy. You really did good. Oh my god. I'll just keep on making the same mistakes. Hoping that you'll understand the baby now. Actually, Nick blew me away, matter of fact. You know, I, I didn't expect Nick to really get down and really dance like that, but I was pleasantly surprised and I'm so glad we chose those songs. I'm so glad, you know, we did the wedding the way we did it. Nero was, was amazing. Um, I, I can't begin to really thank Nero enough, you know, from being, he, he, he kept getting promoted, you know. If there's one person I've been promoted in a short period of time, four years, is, is this man sitting right here. He went from a friend to a boyfriend to a fiance now to an amazing husband the best husband i would say um and a great companion like he he really is my everything yeah. I, I thank god so baby now, take me into your loving arms kiss me under the light of a thousand stars and last but not the least that one man who I have fought with, but I love you so much. From the beginning of this whole process, it's Max Studios and his entire crew. We could not have chosen a much more better photographer or videographer. And I'm so glad that we chose them, so glad that we listened to our instinct and really contracted with them because they really showed such professionalism and so patient with me if you are working with me you have to be patient <laughs> i mean that's really the honest truth and you have to really fear god to not you know go over some boundaries so i thank god for his life and his talents and his business and everything that they have done above and beyond there's no way that any other photographer or videographer could have done what they did even after the wedding he actually decided to go with us to times square so 2 a.m taking pictures like who does that who does that who really does that? I said I love pictures. I love being a spotlight, but I met my match with Max. I mean, I had to give up and say, Max, I can't do it anymore. <laughs> I love you. I love you.